all of my friends. All of my friends are here. Holy macaroni. Look at there. Hi, Cindy Jenks. Your box went out this morning, finally. I'm sorry that I'm so slow. Slow as molasses in January. Hi, Nina. Lee Spadard, my little friend. Your little red wagon. Okay, who's all in Texas? I'm worried about that storm. Hi, Tammy Frazier. Oh, my goodness. And then there's little... Little red wagon. She's dragging that little red wagon. That's her name. Yeah, she's dragging that little red wagon around. Oh, she went to the potty. Okay, she went to the potty. And, um, oh, yeah. Oh, I just made it here just in time because I was ordering. It's just too easy to order stuff online. But Jeffrey wanted pizza. So I ordered pizza and they're going to deliver it. So they're here going to have him some pizza in a little while because he's hungry. Oh, I know what I was going to do. Wait a minute. I got, I'll got. i be right back. I'm going to make these just a minute. Hold, hold your heart. Hi, Debbie Hayes. Oh, my goodness. You guys are beautiful. Just a minute. I got to reach up here and I'm going to get something. I got to walk over here. I'll talk loud while I'm walking over here because I want to get... This thing that's got those doohickeys on it. I don't know why my house is so full of dust. I guess it's because I don't dust things. And I guess I should be dusting things. I guess that's what you're supposed to do. Today I mopped floors and I um I mopped floors and I did two loads of laundry. It took ever bit ouch. Ever oh tacos. Every bit of my energy made me wonder how in the world did I take care of housework, cooking, watching children all at the same time and still had time to run around like a crazy woman when I was young. I ain't young anymore. I got over that young stuff. Well, that won't come out, so I won't use that. Now, let's see. I wonder if... This one will come out. These things get all clogged up, then stickles. Oh, this one will come out. There, so I'll put a stickles in the middle of that flower. Okay. Hi, Gail. Oh, my goodness. And Kathy, like, and Janet. Look at you all looking just so purdy on a Saturday night. Look, this is what I make. I'm making a bunch of these. I had somebody request me to make flags, paperclip flags that you can put in a sewing journal. And so, as luck would have it, I'll put this up here because I got that on there. As luck would have it, I have, I'm able to print out these little apothecary labels. They're just beautiful. They're just beautiful. Hi, Sandy Rector. My goodness. And so that, and they these all have to do with sewing. And I must say that whoever wins door prize today is going to have some of these little apothecary dumaflages in your, in your, um, whatchamacallit. Dumaflages in your whatchamacallit. Oh, man. You know what? I have been having so much trouble with my feet. I know I shouldn't complain, and usually I don't, but good night. You can just only take too much. I think it's the gout. I have had the gout. I got the gout, but it's I have medicine that takes care of the uric acid, so I don't really have any effects from it. But lately, holy smokes, I want to chop my feet off at the ankles. No, I need the ankles off too there. Okay, that's enough complaining about my health. All my other things are well. Everything else is well. So anyhow, these are just adorable. adorable. So I'm going to be making these tonight. This is what, because actually, see, I like to make things. 
I like to have a few handmade items that go in my cigar boxes. Um, I finally got caught up with my orders because I had, you know, quite a few orders, which is a blessing because once I get them orders, then I'm able to get that supports my channel and I'm able to get um, things that I can go further with my with my channel and like what i did was i purchased this here um lifetime membership to this here place where i can cut these things out yeah this is a, a wrist cuffed it's just um crocheted yes and it's um if you, talking about them aches and pains my wrist is, my wristicles hurt. And so I put, you know what I do? I put, it's, it, well, I guess it's like Ben Gay, but it's not Ben Gay. It's actually horse liniment. And I put that, it's, um, I put that on my wrist. And then I put, um, then I wear these on this wrist. Both of them hurt, but this one's the worstest, worstest. And um, is that a word? That's not a word. But you know what I mean. And so, and it helps. So I don't have to complain. Otherwise, I have to complain. So I don't like to complain. So I have to do something to keep from complaining. Papa just rubbed my ankles with that horse liniment. And that made it a little bit better. So I guess I can't complain. I shouldn't complain. I got more wellness than I have illness. So. But these are really cool. I think you'll like them, whoever wins them. Some of these things. Because I got more. Oh, but also I have these. These. Dictionary words. For the winner. Oh. You know what? Last. Hi, Samantha Owens. Um, last week's winner. I'm telling you. I am just... I'm just falling apart at the seams. Last week's winner was the same um, young lady who purchased the auction item. I sent her auction item off, but do you think I just put the um, her um, door prize in with it? No, I didn't. So I'll mail it off, well, Monday. Can't mail it tomorrow because it's Sunday. But I'll mail it tomorrow. Okay, so what I'm going to do here to make these beautiful things. First of all, see what I did to the, the q That is not a Q-tip. See what I did to the paper clip? I made it more fancier. So you can take a, just a, a, a normal old run-of-the-mill I know it, Gail. Geez. Hi, Samantha Owens. Yeah, but I'm sending it on to her. Well, I haven't sent um, Donna hers yet either, but she knows that I haven't um, sent it because I'm getting some stuff together for her for a special journal she's making. And um, she knows I'm slow, and she just lives up the road if she really wanted it all. I bet she'd come get it. I am not very nice, am I? I'm, in there. I'm just, really, but see, look, I just take that and I just curled. See that, how I did that? Just curled that little baby up. Curled the end of that paper clip. And then I'm going to curl the end of this one. So I just, my needle nose pliers, and I just go like this and just, and I seen somebody else do this. I said, oh my gosh, how come I didn't think of that first? But, um, I'm getting it on there. I'm getting it on there. Okay, see? And there it is. It's like both of the ends are curled now. And that sure does give it a snazzy look. And so then, then I have this piece of fabric and I just made it into like a double flag, see, so it'll flip over. And it's about an inch wide and about four inches long, folded in half is two inches long. I figured that out all by myself. And so, 
And then so then I just flip it over here, go through there, see how pretty that is then? And there's that piece of fabric on there. Then I'll take this piece of lace and then put that piece of lace on there. And then I'm going to take my little bottle of glue here and um, I'm telling you, I have been having so much fun doing nothing but arting with Jeffrey. He goes home tomorrow, but I've had him, tonight will be three nights. I'm telling you, am I lucky grandma or what? I'm the lucky grandma. He just offered to pay the pizza, but I said, Jeffrey, I'll pay the pizza man. Because his mom always gives him money, you know, too. So he has money to eat when he's here. And just in case we don't have no food, which of course we're going to have food. Okay, see? And then I'm going to take one of this one's sewing apothecary label. And then I'm going to just put some glue on there. I could just staple it on there, but I'm just using this fabric glue like this way. See? And then I got these beautiful. Oh, you got this. How dare you get distracted, Miss Cindy Jinx? I got these beautiful buttons off of an auction. Um, Vanessa had an auction. And um, I bought her buttons. I bought them buttons because, boy, I like buttons. And I use them buttons. So I said, I'll take them. She goes, how many packs do you want? I said, send them all to me. And she did. I was rich at the moment. You know, she only wanted a dollar for each pack. So I said, send them all to me because I lose, use a lot of buttons in my stuff. So I got me some buttons. Because you guys who support me by buying my, um, um, buying my boxes, my cigar boxes. See, and that's what I make these for, too, because I put a lot of junk in them just so that you have stuff to play with to make decorate your junk journal. You get your journal in there, you know, and then you get a, a journal wrap in there and. Um, and, um, and you get a cigar box full of junk and then you get a, more junk just so I can fill up the box and get rid of some of my junk because it's either throw it in the trash or send it to y'all. So I just send it to y'all. Hi, Dawn. <gasps> Let's make a mess today. Dawn, you know what? I am impressed to see you. I am honored, honored to see you in my room, in my living room. Well, I'm not in the living room. I'm in room B. Yes. And so then I'm just going to tie this ribbon. Now, I think there might be some kind of, I'm putting two little pieces of ribbon on here. I think there might be some kind of a knot I can sew, so a knot, a knot, I mean, not so a tie, so that my, because oh, I want my ribbons, like to hang, one goes like up here and one goes like down here, but. I would like them both just to go down, like down. Because this, this this is going to clip on a side of a page, see? And, and if this sticks up like that, it looks kind of goofy, in, in my own humble opinion. So I'm going to just put a little speckle of glue on there. Just a little speckle. If I can. Uh, wait a minute. I haven't had that lid off that long. Okay, put that in there. Okay, and then I'll put this down on top of there. <laughs> blue and yellow. My color school colors were blue and gold when I was at Lincoln High School in Esco, Minnesota. But then we came to Newport Ritchie, Florida, and then I went to Gulf High School, and our colors were green and white. How boring can you get with that? <gasps> Kendra! Hello, Kendra! I hope you're doing well, my friend. I think about you. 
I think about you and hope you're doing friend, doing friend, doing well. Okay. Um, there, see, so if I glue it down, then my ribbons stay down. So all I used was some a little bit of glue, and I used the uh, um, I, and the button is actually what's stitching it together. And I just put one stitch in there using embroidery floss, and then I have these little flowers. I can put one on there, that, that one. It doesn't matter if it doesn't match exactly. Because I'm the type of person which unicorns, <gasps> storms. <gasps> oh, that's what I was wondering. Who's from Texas? Because I read, well, I didn't, re we don't hardly ever watch the news. But I turned on some news on my computer while I was sitting here drawing. I've been drawing. I can't believe it. And um, Corpus Christi, I think, is where it said it was kind of headed. So, oh, my goodness. But I couldn't tell from that woman. It looked like it was going to hit more in Mexico. Is Corpus Christi, Texas, like, is that way south? Because um, it's wherever the north. East, well, it's round, but the northeast corner of the spiral is where the heaviest bad winds come. So that's where you get the worst winds. So, um, so I don't know. Wherever it hits, I hope everybody's safe. The woman that I listened to, I don't know who she was, but she didn't sound like she had very much experience talking about the weather. She sure wasn't no mother nature. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Okay. But anyway, she said, don't y'all worry nothing about it. I don't think she'd ever been through a hurricane. But anyway, but anyway, that's what she said. Okay, so now this one I'm going to use, let's see, this color of fabric. I like to cut it with my pink and shears. Hi, Karen. Oh, you can't stay long. You're staying busy then. That's good. Yes. It's good to see you even if it's just for a short minute. Even if it's just for a short minute, it's still good to see all my friends. I need friends. Life is lonely when you don't have friends. I cut this with my... I like to use a pink... I have had these pink and shears for so long. I've cut paper with them. I've got everything. <coughs> Excuse me. And they're still cut like a... Like you're cutting through hot butter, like a hot knife through butter. So that was pretty good. Fist scarves. I've had them. I don't even know how long I've had them. I've had them for like about a hundred years. Oh well, that I sure didn't cut it straight though. I cut it like pretty crooked. Hmm. Dang, dang, double dang. Okay, see? So then I just have it folded up. But I put it, I fold it kind of catty wumpus. See? Catty wumpus. Yep. Okay, what are, let's see. Who's going to be okay? Um, Hello, all you. My sister had a heart attack. <gasps> oh, this morning. Oh, how is she doing now? Is she doing better? Oh, I hope she's okay. I don't like to hear about nobody being in the hospital right now. I don't, I mean, for nothing. Oh, for nothing. I, I'm just so, I'm just so anxious about all this COVID thing that it's just got me. It's just got me buffaloed. It's just so sad about the 
COVID thing. I don't want nobody to go in the hospital and then catch the COVID. I worry about my daughter having to be at work. Yes. I hope everybody looked at the um, video about my one auction item. I kind of like, instead of having a whole big old long auction, when I do just one auction item a week, it's perfect because I then am not overwhelmed the day after the auction, getting everything together and getting it all mailed and stuff. That's work, you know. I'm allergic to work. And um, so when I do just one, it's like um, I can get it out right away. Now, who was it that one? Oh, 57. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Well, hopefully it's something... Oh, Karen, hopefully it's something that is um, will be managed okay, that it can be fixed. Because she's got her age going for her then. If she's that young, then she's got her age going for her. And um, hopefully, you know, just one pill and one something and she'll be better. I don't know. And I don't know much about heart problems. Oh, that's so sad. Okay, so I'm going to put this flower right. That's not a flower. It's a button. Mm -mm -mm. My goodness. Okay, so I'm going to put, put um, my button on here. I'm stitching it just with some embroidery floss. Embroidery floss. Um, today I've been working on a on a game. Well, it's going to be sort of a, you know, something like a. Well, it's not going to be a mixed media mashup or anything like that. It's going to be a zentangle, mixed up zentangle something. But I'm because I've been doing these zentangles. Um, Janet VB, very beautiful. Is VB is very beautiful. Okay, ow, jeez. Um, oh, goodness. And so I love using paper clips on my, on my journal pages and I like to look, put a lot of my um, embellishments on paper clips because then you can remove them. You, um, you can remove them when you're journaling and then put them back on. Okay, Cindy says her brother had a heart attack and they put in a stent. It worked great. I hope she has a good outcome too. Yes, we all wish for a great outcome. Do you see my unicorn scissors? Aren't these gorgeous? Mm. Oh, God. Let me see if I can prop my foot right here. All right. Hopefully, Jeffrey's out there waiting for the pizza man. Oh. Okay. We had some storms earlier today. Well, we've been having some storms every day. And then they show that there's hurricanes all out there in the, in the, um, all out there in the, in the Atlantic. So, dang it. I don't know. It, it's like, they're coming a little early this year, although, you know, June actually starts hurricane season, but it usually doesn't get bad till like August and September. So hopefully we don't have much problems this year. Where is Miss Liz? Miss Liz is in Spring Hill, Florida. Right on the Gulf. Well, not right on the Gulf. 
uh, very close to the Gulf. As a bird flies, about two miles from the Gulf of Mexico. And um, yeah, that's that's where I live. That's where I live, and that's where I love. Been been live been living in this same place. Are you going to Janet? I love these. I love these. Hopefully you win the door prize and then you'll get some of these little thingies. Majigs. You know what thingy majigs are, right? I don't have to explain that one to you. Thingy majigs, much more call it. I think it, when, once you get to my age, we know all about thingamajigs and what you might call it and doohickeys because we have a lot of those then. They just appear out of nowhere. And Teresa's going to make some too. I think they're so pretty and I love the fabric. So if you're doing a sewing journal, then that fabric is perfect. And you can use different fabrics, different laces, different buttons, and these little sewing paper things, apothecary labels, are just a cat's meow. A cat's meow. And they're just pretty. And so I'm... Um, oh, did I show you my unicorn scissors? Aren't they beautiful? They were a gift from a beautiful subscriber. I've gotten so many gifts. Don't send me no more gifts, though, because... If you send me more gifts, I have to get a room built onto my house. But actually, I've been um, able to send off nice happy mails because all my old junk. Oh, don't tell anybody I said it was junk. Um, um, oh, three minutes before the bidding starts. Let me just show you, show you a real quick. I have this envelope here. And it has got 40 images in it. And let me just real quickly kind of show you. These are all, somebody said they are vintage because they're more than 20 years old. These are at least, the, these have got a date of 1970 or 71 on the backs. Each one are copies of images that I guess were famous at one time. Or probably still are famous. But there's. 40 different images, different sizes, beautiful pictures, beautiful, look how beautiful, Madonna, I love this one, she's beautiful, look at this one, oh, I wish I was beautiful, that's so pretty, look at these images, I'm just showing you real quickly, just in case you didn't see the video, I showed them quicker on the video, but see someone, this was probably like a four by six, and then there's bigger ones that go up to, but there's 40 of them. And these are, oh, what did somebody call these? These are a, um, um, I forget what you called them now again. Um, yeah, but anyway, that's what they are. And so these are really, really, I say they're nice. Every one of them is in the original wrap, in their original wrap. So although the, like some of the headers are like chewed up by something. Um, the images are still in their original wrap. But there's 40 different ones. Gosh, somebody told me what these were called now and I can't remember it now. Hamilton. See, it's, they got a name under them. See, that's a Hamilton. That one says Northumberland. Marlboro. Coat of Arms. Coat of arms, yeah. Okay, and so this one says Coventry, Buckingham, but they're pretty. This one is almost looks oriental, but it's not oriental. Um, but it is so different and so pretty. And and somebody told me that back in the 70s when because these were these are all dated 70 or 71. And some of them were this one was printed in USA. Some of them are printed in Italy. I don't know, hon. I don't know what kind of paper these are on. It's 
It's heavier than copy paper and it's lighter than cardstock. So, and I don't want to unwrap them. This one here I can kind of feel in there and feel that it's like heavy, heavier than cardstock. Look at this. I just think these are amazing with that black background. There's two different ones like that with these horses. And um, these they call these the dummy whisk. D-U-M-M-Y-W-H-I-S-T. Three gentlemen sitting here playing cards and having some brandy. That's what I think they're having. I love this one. It says art gallery. Look at that. You, somebody can do something really pretty with that one. I like the color art gallery. That is pretty. But there's two of these ones with the plant and the butterflies. And that's pretty. This is another one of the um, those dummies playing cards. Oh, there's another guy back there. He must be filling his glass with some more brandy. And there's, this is what I said. There was two of these with the butterflies. And then this one is pretty. This one's big. Now, this one's like about an 8 by 10 maybe. I didn't actually measure them. And then this one is a probably 8 by 10. I love that one, too. It says, Hilltop Barn by Nepai. Isn't that pretty with the daisies? I love that one. And then this. Look at this lady. Isn't she just beautiful? Look how beautiful she is. And then this one here. Yeah, it says Litho, Jerusalem Inn in Nottingham. That's what that says. I didn't see that last night when I was going over it. They, they are all pretty, though. But there's 40 different prints. And um, there's 40 different prints in there. And then I'm going to add... I'm going to add one of these because everybody loves these. Um, um, yeah, I'm going to add that, and then I'm going to add. Um, oh, no, I don't really know where that other paper went. I'm going to add a couple of prints, printouts, a couple of printout things. But I'm going to recycle. I'm going to recycle this here envelope that I got a book in that I ordered from Amazon. So I can put them all in that envy right there. And whoever gets them will be the envy or oh, whatever. I think they're great. I think they're awesome. And I think they're going to be fun to work with. And since there's 40 and enough to share, enough to use, enough to share. So, and thank you all. I'm telling you, I have been able to purchase... I'm really getting into my Zentangle art, and so I have been able to order, like, this book I got, Zentangle Dingbats. Um, okay, I think there was another. Oh, Zenspirations, ABCs. Oh, I love this book. But see, I'm able, because you all are um, supporting my channel. By buying my trash, I mean my stuff, um, then I can get things that help me learn. And as I learn, I can share with you. And and I love it. I'm just, and I'm so happy that I'm able to do that. And so, and if it wasn't for you all helping me out that way, I wouldn't be able to do that. Because, like I said before, Hubster and I, have, we've got enough to make a living. We, we go month to month, you know, but that's all we need. We don't need. We got enough. We've always got enough. But then what little bit, what I make is always what I can earn on my crafties. Um, that is for, that is for my habit <laughs> oh and river hi river okay see i love these to turn to curl these paper clips 
I love to curl the ends of them. I just think that looks so pretty with the little curled up edge. Maybe I could go a little bit closer. Um, yeah, I think you guys will know a whole lot more about those prints than what I know because I'm, I'm not real. Oh, this is better. There we go. Now we can see. Because um, I'm not real good at knowing famous artists in their pictures. Um, Picasso is probably the only one. You can look at Picasso and say, oh, that's a Picasso. But, um, oh, and then there's another guy. Who is that guy? He's got a, he's got a museum down in, in Tampa where he's got, like, he'll paint a table and it's got horse legs on it or something and a eyeball in the middle of it or something. So, yeah. So I'm not sure. You all might know a whole lot more by looking at them than what I know. And so, but, and I still have more. So I've got some to use mound self, mounding self. So, but they're fun. They I have to tell, oh, you know what I'll do? I have to tell you that there's, um, because they've been packed away, they've got that, like, the plastic smell, old plastic, because they're all in plastic, but I do not believe that the, I think the images inside will be fine, and, and what you can do is, um, well, what, I can do is I can put a dryer sheet or two in, but then I don't know. Um, um, the dryer sheet to make them smell better. But another thing you can do when you find something that smells a little bit old, you know, like an old book or something, is to wrap it in newspaper. Thank you for coming by. Thank you so much for coming by. Um, Dawn, you are amazing and you're beautiful and you are lovely and you are caring and you are my friend. And, um, and you are awesome. Did I say that part? I don't want to forget that part. See, I don't actually have to probably glue all these ribbons down because actually what I also like is for ribbons and stuff to stick out the side of a, out of a journal. Stuff, fluff, I like fluff out the sides. So, <coughs> ditto kiddo. Okay, and then... Man, I just love these buttons I got from from um, from um, Vanessa's auction. That was that was great. That was great, 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 great. Okay, now there's my needle. Okay, there's my needle. Okay, I've been working on a game that I'm going to start doing. Well, it's not well like a game, but it's going to be a Zentangle. Um, Oh, I don't know how to even. It's going to be like a doodle, a doodle, a doodling, because we're going to pull a card, and it's going to be what you got to doodle. Be what you doodle is going to be on the card, the doodle cards. It's going to be a doodle together, and I want to do it as a live stream, So, but I'm not going to do it on my Saturday night live stream. I'm going to find another night. Or afternoon or something. And um, but it's gonna be fun. I'll just but I have a lot of people. I was I'm surprised as how many people are going, oh, I don't think I did did no, I did not do a Zentangle today. On my um, 
on my channel. Oh, some days I forget. You all have to forgive me. I'll do it tomorrow for sure, though. Because I got started with this new game I'm making. And so I've been drawing, drawing it. My dad had a picture on his wall of that print. Which print was that, Teresa? I I love, I, there's a lot of them that are just amazing. I love them, them guys playing cards or drinking brandy or whatever they're doing. And, um, oh, the girl with the long red hair. When I looked at that one, I thought of Anne with an E. Anne with the E from Anne of Green Gables. That's what I thought because she had the long red hair. And when I saw that picture, that's who it made me think about was Anne with the E. Actually, I think there's two of them in there. I think there was. Well, maybe not. Maybe there was only one. I don't know. I'm not too bright. I'm not the brightest bulb on the tree. But, yeah, that was one of the little ones, like a five by set. No, I don't think it was even that big. Four by six, maybe. But I can just see them put on a... On a um, front of a journal, and also I had there's a couple ladies that got cigar boxes that are decoupaging their cigar boxes. You know, one lady asked me, "Just send me a very plain one because I'm going to be decoupaging the whole thing," and so. So um, they would be pretty undecoupaged on a cigar box. I like these. I think these are pretty. See there? And each one of them says sewing and then a different, a different image. There's scissors here and it looks like an embroidered or a crocheted something there. And it says apothecary at the bottom. These are really, really pretty. And um, very, 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 very pretty. Very pretty. So, okay. So, we remember to keep in our thoughts and our healing vibes and stuff for everyone over there in the path of the storm. I know our Janie, trucker Janie is in San Antonio and they mentioned San, San Antonio. So I know she's over there. Um, then there's, there's a few I can't think of names right now. Barbara Batzer is over there in Texas. I'm not sure exactly where she is. And, but, I mean, I just, I wish the storm would just go to some deserted place. Some deserted place. That's what I would want. And I don't know if they're going to give me any choice, though. If they'll give me any choice of where it goes. And, um, oh, this piece of fabric is pretty. It's got sparkles in it. Sparkles, sparkles, sparkles. I bought some of these strips. You can get the jelly roll strips from, um, from, I've ordered them from, Hmm. Joann's because they had them for 50% off and free shipping. I said, boy, you're talking my language, free shipping. And um, since I don't go out shopping anywhere, 
And so I got me some because I make my prayer quilts out of these, my little pocket prayer quilts. I still have a couple of those that I know I've, I've told people I will send them one and I haven't done that yet. So I, but I didn't get into it. I got it all. Oh, are we done? Are we done bidding? I see a congrats, Renee. Oh, okay. Let me write that down. Okay, Renee, I'm going to have to get your, um, it shouldn't be much for the shipping because I'm sending it in. Oh, your little red wagon, Renee, oh, Renee. Renee for the, um, for the print. And I'll go ahead and figure out what the shipping is, Renee. And um, I believe I've got your address. You know what, Renee? Give it to me anyway in the email. And that way I can figure out exactly what your shipping is. And then I will go ahead and um, invoice you. And then I can have it mailed off on Monday. And... I hope you really like them. So now I don't know. I was thinking about um, putting in a dryer sheet for this to kind of suck up some of that odor. But I don't know if I should do that because of um, Oliver. I don't know if that would be something he would be allergic to or something. And so... But, oh, thank you so much, Renee. I hope you find wonderful things to do with them. And okay, then also now, um, Gail, if you want to do the door prize now as well, we can get that done. The door prize is going to be printouts. So I can, I'm able to print out such wonderful printouts, which you'll get some of these apothecaries and the door prize will also have a page of these we'll all cut some of them apart but you'll get a page of these um um these we all love these um <gasps> dictionary words and look at these how cute you'll get one half of that these are just little farm animals i had a couple other that i print out today but um to have to have and to hold. And so. Oh, and there's Mary Tao. Hello. How are you? I don't think I saw you. I'm glad to see you here now, though. Better late than never. And maybe you've been here the whole time, but I've been just asleep or something. Sometimes I'm just asleep. Let me put that one up there. I have to get some. Yes, we do need your addresses in the file in Scrap and Lizzie Unicorns. That's good to have your addresses there. But um, we have Violet who is fixing up our address files now and she's doing a good job but for some reason they went all kaput there for a while oh i didn't put a piece of lace on there oh well this one's not going to have lace on them but when i make these up i make them i think i started saying it i don't know i finished but i um i make them up because i like to add them to my um My, um, oh God, I can't even talk. Bingo, not bingo. Um, um, cigar box collections. And, and so I like to have a few things that I've made. Plus I also put in things that you all can make things on your own. See, I kind of like that one too without putting any more, just the fabric and the um, 
and the apothecary label and the button and the little ribbon here. It doesn't really even need ribbon on the side. It's pretty. Oh, ready to choose a card. Oh, I don't have Papa in here to help me today. So I have to pull my own card. Jeez. Just a minute. Just a minute. He's out there with Jeffrey. Okay. He's out there with you. Well, where's my book? Just a bit. I'm going to pull a card. Okay. Where's my bucket? Well, there's my bucket. Oh, thank goodness I didn't kick the bucket. Yeah. Now, here I got this bucket. Well, here's the bucket. Oh, look, I see numbers still, though. Okay. We're going to pick a card, any card. We're going to um, pick this one right here. Okay, this one. 55. 55. Oh, we still, are we ready already? Because I see more numbers coming up. 55 is the number, is the winner's. That's the winner number, winner number. Number of the winner. Sorry, y'all are late. Oh, well, if they didn't come nowhere clear, clear they, that one's over. That one's not close. Yeah, I guess I should tell you all that we'll always do the door prize drawing right after the auction item. When I start to have, whenever I do my, um, my new game, I'm going to start. Yeah, you had said stop. When, I, when I'm when i going to start my new little Zentangle thing, when I get it ready to go, then I'm not sure if I'm going to have a, when I'm going to do it. It might be like in the morning or something, on the mornings. But I think it'll be fun. Oh, we have a winner. Oh. Sandy. Sandy's the winner for the door prize. Okay, so what's Sandy's whole name? Wait a minute, where's my pencil? Where's my pencil? Oh, there it is. There's, oh, there's my pencil. Sorry, I was checking to see if my address was in the files, but no, it's not there. Oh, Teresa, you need to put it there. Sandy Rector. Is that who it is? Yes, Sandy Rector. And she is the door prize winner. Now, I want everybody to know that I, okay, just put it in the comment. I think there, you can just put it in the comments below. And um, put it in the comments below it, and it should get put in there. Now, if there's anybody out there that has, um, that I have not sent a door prize to or not sent something that I said I would send, I do not mind being reminded. So if you have been expecting something from me and you did not get it, then you remind me and because sometimes I need those reminders. Um, yeah, stuff is getting a little slow up there in the north area of my body. Yeah. And so, so yes, if I owe you something, because now sometimes I, um, sometimes I have been, you know, somebody asks me if I can send them this or that. And then I say, oh, yeah, I can do that. And then, uh, you know, then I don't write it down and then I forget. So I do not mind at all being reminded to do things. So please help my brain. Yes. And I think Facebook made some changes, too. My whole Facebook thing looks different. And so I think they made some changes. And 
and then I can't find stuff and but then that might be me making changes in my brain. I don't know. I don't just know. I just don't even know. Some of these, I might, instead of putting this ribbon on, I might put some other different fibers. Because I got different fibers too. But they're going to all have the little fabric. I love the fabric. I love these little... Um, Apothecary labels and the pretty buttons. Hi, Jackie. Good to see you. I changed mine back to the old way. You can do that. Oh, I am going. Okay. Oh, Mary is waiting for unicorn magic. I know about that. Unicorn magic. Ooh, ooh. Well, I can't do that button. That needle won't go through it. The hole's too little. Okay, put that one back in the box. Let's put this one up here then. Okay, I might, at least on my computer I could. Okay, I'm going to see if I can find where that option is to change it back to the old way. Because I don't like the new way. It's it's too many differences. It might be an okay way. But once I get used to something one way. It's just. It, it's just. It gets stuck in my head. And then if I have to learn to do something different. Oh forget it. It's just not good. It's just not good at all. Jackie you working on your baby books? I'm sure you are. I know you've been doing the, the doodle tangles. Been doing an awesome job with them. An awesome job with the doodle tangles. I'm loving them. And I'm, um, Grandma Reese. Oh, okay. No, I didn't trick you, darling. I forgot to put it in the box. Well, actually, I couldn't fit it in the box. And I have not even mailed it off yet. But it is here. And I am going to send it to you. So I'll probably mail it off on Monday. But I have it right. In fact, here it is right here. That's yours right there. See, that's it right there. But I just, it's crazy. I'm a crazy woman. But it's going to get mailed to you on Monday. That one's yours. And I meant to put it in the box. But then I stuffed. Did you like all them? I hope you did like them stamps. I stuffed that box full of more stamps. than I got a whole empty drawer now. Yeah. So, yeah, you'll get this. You'll definitely get this, darling. I'm telling you. I'm just. Oh. I don't know. But you know, guys, no, I'm I knew that you'd be fine with it. I'm glad you got the box. So that was heavy, wasn't it? <laughs> but um, I'm glad that you got the box and all that. I've got a whole empty drawer now that I can cram other stuff in because I wasn't using the rubber stamps. Every once in a while I'd use one. And so I'm gonna read some heart thoughts and because I'm just a, oh, she helped you sort through them. Oh, good. There was some pretty ones. And some of them I don't know, but um, I figured you could pick out your faves. But anyhow, um, I'm going to read Heart Thoughts today. And let's see. I am free, this one says. This one is about freedom. I'm going to, um, let's see. That's a Christmas card from my sanitation worker from last week uh last year okay you can choose to be i am free okay you can choose to be that part of your spirit that is totally free if you can be free in one area you can be free, be free in many areas be willing to be free um i affirm the following i am pure spirit and light and energy. I see myself as being free. 
I am free in my mind. I am free in my emotions. I am free in my relationships. I am free in my body. I am free in my life. I allow myself to connect to that part of me that is pure spirit and that is totally free. I release all of my limitations and my human mind fears. I no longer feel stuck. I realize that I am far more than my personality, my problems, or my dis-ease. The more I connect with this part of me, the more I can free in every area of my life. The part of me that is pure spirit knows how to lead me and guide me in the ways that are very beneficial. I trust the spirit part of me and know that it is safe for me to be free. I am free in my love for myself. I let that love for myself flow as freely as possible. It is safe to be free. I am spirit and I am free. That's good. Yes, thank you. Oh, um, oh, the the hummingbird. Yeah, that one was like one of the best. Yep. Okay, thank you so much, Gail. Good night to you. God bless each and every one of them. May watch over, watch over you every step you take, every move you make. And I will see you on the next video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I know there's others online, too, that are doing lives tonight. So go catch. Maybe Beth is on still. I like watching her. She's such a sweetheart. Okay. Um, I got to go check on my children, though. I mean, my children. That would be my husband and my grandson. Okay. God bless you all. And I will see you on the next. Bye-bye.